Assalamualaikum. Uh, good morning, everyone. It is just eight, a few minutes past eight in the morning, and we're on our way to the Say hi. Hi. <laughs> so, I'm going to keep you guys posted on whatever. I'm just going to take you guys along with me, and we'll see how it goes. So, I'm just going out now to the meeting point. Thank <laughs> you. 
it's me again so before i end this vlog i just want to say a few words a few things would you believe if i tell you that this is my first ever trip when like ever in sudan ever since i came to sudan it is my first trip in like what four years so there have been trips like organized by school by student association student buddies here and there but i just didn't have the like i just didn't feel that i needed to go because it was not easy for me to be honest like being here alone without a family and i've been going my dad is a very adventurous person he always takes us on trip on trips so we always go to trips with him and it was not really it was not easy for me like leaving home coming here alone and just going on trip i couldn't ever imagine like going on a trip without my dad so it was really hard for me to do so but now that i went on this one it felt really good there were a lot of memories floating because sabalogo if you're in kano and you know together it's just like together the place is quiet it's, it's peaceful and it's so it's nice to be there like anywhere that's close to water is actually peaceful and quiet for it's nice for one to be there so sabaloga is a very interesting place as i've shown you and inshallah i'm looking forward to going on a lot of trips now because i've recovered from the like it's not shock i wouldn't call it shock that will be too, too dramatic but i don't know what to call it to be honest and also if you're in Kano, you should check Tegadam because that place is a really nice place to be. There's, I know it's been like, it's been really long um, for me to be there. But when we were there, there were like camel rides. You go on a boat ride and also play and hike also. So when, you, when, when, when we were hiking there, it reminded me of a time we hiked in Tegadam with my siblings and how everybody was trying to raise to, to be the first person to reach the top of the rocks and all. So it was really nice adventure and it was a really nice experience. I just love it. Like it was really nice. I loved it. It brought a lot of memories back. And guess what you guys, my video, my niqab story, um, sorry, the niqabi sisters is has over a thousand views. Thank you guys for so much support. Thank you guys for the love and support. I really appreciate it. And also, I noticed something most people that view my channel or watch my videos they are not they have not subscribed to my channel oh my god i'm panting i've been working actually so that's why and i figured out i had to make this video that's why i'm panting so most of people that view my channel they are not they have not subscribed to my channel so can you please if you can take your time to watch my videos i think it's something interesting that will bring you back to my channel so if you want to have notifications or get notified when I have a new video and also be part of the family, please subscribe to my channel if you watch it. It will, re it will really mean a lot to me. I love the support. I love the love and everything. Thank you guys so much. And guess what you guys, Ramadan is just in a few days, like a little over 30 days. So it's just around the corner. You know what you we should be expecting all. We are expecting inshallah. I'm planning to have a series of Ramadan just like I have had before. The last Ramadan I have had my Ramadan series. So inshallah this Ramadan also I'll be having one. And also before Ramadan I'll be dropping in a few videos for Ramadan. How to get prepared for Ramadan and everything inshallah. So thank you so much for the love and support. Give me a thumbs up. Subscribe, comment and share it out with your friends. Show people. We are going to show I'm um, on earth mission just like Odemaya to show people what Sudan has to offer to the world inshallah I hope hopefully I get there but inshallah I am on this mission as well if I get the chance wherever I go I'll carry you guys along with me and show people what Sudan has to offer it's not just the desert it's not just the great sense or taste of tea that they have it's a lot more that they have to offer to the world and they have so much treasure in this place so thank you so much Meet you all in my next video. Bye.